Hello everybody, welcome back to another tutorial from me here with Street Clean. Today I'm going to explain to you guys how to uh, import the Explorer, which just got released actually um, the 28th uh, February. So um, yeah, so I'm instantly already going to make a tutorial on that before I get tons of questions on how to import it and all that stuff. Um, so the only thing you will need is a skin and obviously an asset on extractor. Um, you can go ahead and open that, go to file, open. Uh, then you go to your Flash and Lights folder, which I have um, already a favorite, so that's nice. And then you open the source assets. Now the only thing you have to do is find the name, and name is going to be um, a Vehicle Facts 01 Exterior, which is for the Explorer mark. Um, yeah, and then you need to make sure it's a texture file. Then you can simply edit this, load, uh, go to your desktop, and um, in this case I'm putting the uh, Utah Explorer uh, yeah, Highway Patrol uh, skin in. Um, for the Unmarked Explorer, it's going to be Vehicle Facts U1 Xtavio uh, Stripe Diff underscore PD2, uh, but all those information will be in the description and there's a special form for that as well. So I'm going to quickly also replace the uh, Unmarked. Uh, hello? I don't see. It. Uh, I don't see it. Oh, it's somewhere here. PD here. You go. That's the one. PD two uh, texture this PD two, and I make sure it's a texture file. Then simply go edit, load, and then simply load the same skin. Um, which is nice about the Explorer is that they have the same DZ template, so you can technically put a LPD. Uh, normal marked skin on the uh, on the unmarked, and now you have pretty much a select of PD, which will actually look really cool. Um, so I'm gonna press OK, press OK again, um, and that's pretty much it. Um, if it wants to load now, and it's about to crash. Okay, it, it, so it needs to take a while sometimes. Okay. Um, then you press OK. Uh, it will ask you where you if you would like to save it. Simply go to your desktop. Um, in this case, I'm going to save it here because for some reason it doesn't find it here. But you can just place it anywhere you want. Then simply, let me just go ahead and get the file. All right, so I have the file here, and then simply put it in flash files data, um, which is this uh, location. Uh, pretty much, you go to your Steam apps, come on, and that's it. And then, well, actually, Steam games. Well, for me it's different, but Steam apps come on, and then there you go, flash lights, flash lights data, and that's it. Um, and that's pretty much all you have to do, and I can pretty much start up flash lights. Alright, we are just in game. Um, I already have the CVPR in charge load with the Utah Highway Patrol. EP, um, and this is going to be the uh, Explorer. And this is going to be the MR. Totally uh, changed. Let's go ahead and use the MR. Oh. Personally, not a big fan of the Explorer, but Flash and Lights has made my, uh, uh, changed my opinion, really. As you can see, it's really changed. Um, it looks good. So yeah, that's where you replace the Explorer. Um, and other than that, there's like three or four more tutorials, um, actually a ton more tutorials that explain how to modding and make sure to check out the playlist if you have, um, if you need to know about any other vehicle which I'm gonna make uh, as soon as possible. Um, and if you have any questions, just leave them in the in the God damn it. leave that in the comments below or just go ahead and join the Discord server from Flash Nights, which will be a link in the description. Um, and all other than the flash and nice mods, flmods.com, that's, that's the place where you get the mods. So uh, yeah, hopefully this answered your questions, and if you have any more feedback or any suggestions what I should make or do, then go ahead and let me know in the comments as well. Uh, and all of that, have a very nice day.